Hey guys, I'm sorry about the lighting and the crappy quality. I am recording from my iPod because my laptop still doesn't work. So, if I record from my fancy HD camera, I won't be able to upload it for a while. And I'm impatient, so I'm recording here. And oh my god, my hair, I'm sorry guys. And sorry about the bird, he's weird. Um, but yeah, I have 50 random questions that I found online when I googled it, because why not? Shh. Sorry. Um, and so I'm going to answer them. Uh, okay. <laughs> Question number one. What is your best friend's mom's name? Her name is Sally. <laughs> Great question. Very interesting response. Um, where is the weirdest place you've had a mole? I don't actually think that I have... Anyway. Stop it. <sighs> hey guys, this is my bird. Um... And there he goes. Uh, anyway. Uh, I don't think I have any moles. I have freckles, if that counts. I have a lot of freckles on my arms. I don't know if you can even see them. Just trust me, I have a lot of freckles. Um, but since I don't have any moles, I guess I'll tell you the weirdest place I have a freckle. And that would be on my stomach, I think. Like right, like here. I don't know. Kind of weird, I think. Um, number three, who was the hottest teacher you ever had? I honestly have never had a hot teacher, I don't think. At least not that I can remember. I'm sorry to be boring about that, but yeah. <laughs> number four, have you ever made out in a movie theater? Yes, yes I have. Um, yeah. I don't think we need any details about that, but yes I have. Number five, what body part do you wash first? Um, I don't know if this really counts as a body part, but I wash my hair first. Does that count as a body part? If it doesn't count as a body part, I wash my face after my hair. So, first my hair, then my face. Let's just say my hair first, because that's what I do. Number six, do you hover over the toilet in public bathrooms? I try not to use public bathrooms, because... You know, they're kind of gross, but but when I do, no, I don't hover. If the toilet seat is wet, I will either clean it off or pick a different stall. Because obviously I'm not going to sit in urine, but I'm not going to hover over a urine-covered toilet seat because my balance sucks and I would probably fall and end up sitting on it anyway. So I just wipe it off or pick a different one. But I try not to use them overall. I don't usually. Um... What's the strain number seven? What's the strangest talent you have? I don't really have any talents. I am a talentless loser. But something I can do that a lot of people can't is I can make a four-leaf clover out of my tongue. My brother calls it a mutant tongue. Whatever you want to call it, I can do it. Um, That was the stupidest face I've ever made. Um, but yeah, I can do that. Don't know if that really counts. <laughs> but um, yeah. Number eight, do you have an innie or an outie? Um, I have an innie. And I have other vi videos. Well, yeah, videos, that's a word. I have other videos where I show my belly button because of my lower navel piercing. So... Yeah, great. Um, number nine, what's your favorite flavored Pringles? The original. I don't like that pizza crap or whatever else they have. I like the fucking originals. So good. <laughs> Hands down. No, no, no competition. I'm retarded. Uh, original Pringles. Red tube that I can't fit my hand all the way in. 
Pringles needs to make their can just a little wider because my hand doesn't fit in there anymore. But anyway, number 10, have you ever been tied up? Do you want to be? My answer to both those questions is no. However, also on my YouTube channel somewhere, if you scroll through the old ones, um, I did one time duct tape my brother's hands and feet together and then he rolled around on the floor. I am not a freak. Well, I mean, I am, but not in this way. I didn't do that for a sexual purpose. It was just like the middle of summer and I was bored. So I duct taped his hands and feet together and recorded it. But yes, number 11. What was the last thing you have ever gotten grounded for? First of all, that's improper grammar. You should not, I'm a grammar Nazi, you should not end a sentence in a preposition. For is a preposition. So, I'm just saying, I'm a grammar Nazi, you can't do that. But to answer that improper question, um, I honestly don't remember. I don't, I don't actually know. Sorry. Number 12. Do you parallel park or drive around the block? I don't actually have my license yet. Um, because I wasn't really interested in driving for a while. I just got my permit February. So, yeah, haven't even tried to parallel park yet. So, I guess my answer would be drive around the block, but I don't have my license, so. Yeah. <laughs> Um, number 13. Have you ever had two dates in one night? That's hilarious. I don't think I've ever in my life actually had a legitimate date. Like, I have a girlfriend. Two years and six months we've been dating. But, I don't know, do people actually go on dates nowadays? I don't know. So, I don't think I've ever even had one in one night, let alone two. Um, so, number 14. How many times have you been cussed out? It's also a funny question. Probably many, many, many. More than I have ever been able to keep track of. Because I tend to be a bitch. So, yeah. Um, number 15. Which shoe do you put on first? My right shoe, usually. Sometimes it's my left, but usually I'm pretty sure it's my right. <laughs> Number 17. Have you ever been to a gay bar? Well, I'm not 21, so I've never been to a bar, period. But, <laughs> I am bisexual, so I wouldn't be against going to a gay bar. However, I am also straight edge, so I don't drink or smoke or bleh. I don't drink or smoke or do drugs or any of that crap. So if I went, I wouldn't drink. But no, I've never been to one. However, I probably would go. Um, number 18, girls, dash, dash. That's not really a question. I'm not kidding. It, goddamn, where is it? Just says girls, dash, dash. Um, I don't know what to say to that. Girls have vaginas. Boys have penises. Good answer? Not a question? Okay, number 19. Is there one thing all of your love interests have had in common? I don't think so. Probably the fact that I shouldn't have liked that person. Someone that's basically not someone I should be interested in. Uh, does that count? I don't know. Um, number 20. Did you French kiss before you were 16? First of all, who still calls it French kissing? Don't most people call it making out? But, um, yeah, I did. <laughs> um, I'm only 17 now, so, yes, I have. Um, 21. Have you ever been cow tipping or snipe hunting? I honestly have no idea what snipe hunting is. I probably should have looked it up before I answered these questions, but no. I love animals more than people, so I would never just like push a cow over. However, I have been people tipping. It is hilarious when I see people for me. 
it's hilarious to see people fall. I mean, I'm sorry, my nose is so itchy. Um, I think it's funny to watch people fall over, but a cow, I might cry. Yeah, so, um, 22. Who is the last person you usually think about before you fall asleep? It depends, like, if I had a rough day and something happened with someone or about someone or whatever, then I'll be thinking about that person. But if I'm just laying in bed trying to, like, calm down and fall asleep, it'll probably be my girlfriend. But otherwise, it's just depends on what happened throughout the day. Number 23. Have you ever had a poem or song written about you? No. People don't love me. <laughs> surprise, surprise, that's so weird. Anyway, 24. If you had to choose to not ever wash your bed sheets again or not wash your bath towel ever again, which would you rather not wash? Um, I would honestly rather not wash my bed sheets. Either way, they would both get disgusting, but I don't know, I'd just be kind of grossed out more if I had a dirty bath towel. And I just get out of the shower from, like, you know, cleaning my body and then just rubbing a dirty bath towel all over my body. Which seems kind of stupid to me. I don't know. I don't know. I just kind of... I don't know. And then, like, a bath towel would get... Wouldn't it get, like, moldy, maybe? Because it's all wet and... I don't know. 25. Have you ever found anything in your parents' bedroom that was questionable? I'm assuming this is referring to, like... Well, this might just be my mind going down the dirty path because I have a dirty mind. I'm assuming this means, like, condoms, dildos, vibrators, sex toys, stuff like that. Um, no. I've never found anything sexual in my room. I don't know. I don't think so. 26. What was your childhood... Child... Wow, I'm retarded. Oh my god, I can't even talk. Um... Childhood nickname. Um, before I was born, I was supposed to be a boy, and my name was going to be Anthony Tyler, and so my aunt would rub my mom's belly and call me Ty. Does that count? Uh, yeah, and then when I was little, my aunt tried to get the, yeah, my aunt and nicknames, they kind of go well together. Um, she tried, my middle name is Brielle, if you follow me on Twitter, which you probably don't, you would know that, but my middle name is Brielle, and so my aunt tried to get the nickname Brie to catch on, because apparently she has a thing for calling me by my middle name, Anthony Tyler, she called me Ty, Angela Brielle, she wanted to call me Brie, I don't know, but if that counts, other than that, I've just been called Angela, because... My mom won't let anyone call me Angie because she doesn't like that name, I guess. Oh my god, I can't even talk. I'm sorry. Um, yeah. 27. When was the last time you played the air guitar? I don't actually play the air guitar. Like, is that, I don't know. But when I'm listening to music in the car with my mom usually, because not like I have friends, um... I do, like, you know how you sing in the car? Well, I pretend to be a guitar. Like, instead, like, if a song's playing and it gets to, like, a guitar solo or whatever, I will make guitar noises along with the guitar. So, yeah. <laughs> um, 28. Have you ever peeked in the opposite sex's locker room? No. No. 